Hey everyone here from Tunnel Vision TV and in today's tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to create an awesome selective color effect using After Effects. So first of all let's just bring in our footage so drag it into your project area and let's drag that into a new composition. So I just have a shot here of a little zombie walking around and what I want to do is I want to make the shot black and white but I want to leave the blood red. So let's get started. So first of all, let's just duplicate our footage layer. And then on the top layer, I'm going to create a mask. Just make sure you're on the first frame. And I'm going to draw a very rough mask just around the blood area. Just something like that. And let's just switch off our bottom layer for now. And then on that first mask, so I'm just going to press M. And on that first mask, I'm going to do a track mask. So right click on that mask, do track mask. And then here in the bottom corner, I'm going to click on track forward and let's just give that a couple of seconds so it's going to track uh, the footage and it's going to just give us a nice um, moving uh, rotoscope a rough rotoscope around that area okay there we go so if we play through this now you'll see uh, that that mask is moving uh, along quite nicely and let's just give it some feather so just go into the mask properties and let's change the feather to around 10. so let's play through that quickly perfect Okay, next what you want to do is you want to right click on that top layer and go to effects, go to color correction and then go to leave color. Okay, and then you're going to click on this little uh, eyedropper and let's just select a red from the footage and let's change the amount to the color to 100% and let's change the edge softness to around 10 and let's see how that looks like. Um, okay, that's all right. And the tolerance, you can obviously also just adjust and see what works best for you. So I'm going to set it on 5%. That's looking pretty good. And then I'm going to enable my uh, layer below that. And then on that layer, I'm going to add a tint effect. So go to effects, color correction, and tint. And there you've got your effect. So really simple and it looks really good. So what you can do now, you can pre-compose both these layers. So just select them both, right click and go to pre-compose. Um, just give it a name, click on OK, and then we can do some grading on this pre-comp. So let's just go to color correction again, and let's add a curves effect. And let's just add some contrast to this, something like that. And let's see how that looks like. Cool, so that's looking pretty good. And obviously you can only uh, try and use the leaf color effect on your, uh, on your footage, but usually you'll pick up some uh, strange effects on the background. And that's why you want to isolate that area with uh, using a mask and then you uh, will be sure that the effect will be um, as good as possible. Cool, so I hope you guys enjoyed this quick After Effects tutorial. Uh, if you like it, please give me a thumbs up. And yeah, if you want to see more, uh, remember to click that subscribe button. And yeah, thanks for watching. Cheers, bye.